Gauri fifth guru blessed is the bro bowing to thee and blessed are the eyes having sight of thee blessed are those devotees who are in love with thee without devotion to the naam the name of the lord how can peace be found with your tongue chant the glorious praises of the name of the lord nanak is a sacrifice unto those who meditate on the immaculate lord gauri fifth guru you are my guide you are ever with me you alone preserve protect and care for me such is omni present lord that he is my support in this and world beyond o my brother he saves the honor of his servants he under whose power is this world and hereafter too he is the master day and night o myself meditate on the lord god his honor is approved and he alone comes to bear the mark of the true name for whom the lord himself issues the royal command the lord himself is the giver and himself the cherisher continually continuously o nanak dwell upon the name of the lord gauri fifth guru when the perfect true guru becomes merciful god the nurturer of the universe ever abides within the man's heart meditating on the lord i have found eternal peace the sovereign lord the perfect king has shown his mercy unto me nanak says one blessed with the perfect good fortune meditates on the name of the lord god and eternal conjugal bliss is conferred upon him gauri fifth guru he opens his loin cloth and spreads it out beneath him like a donkey he gulps down all that comes his way without good deeds liberation is not obtained the wealth of salvation is procured by remembering the name of the lord he performs worship ceremonies applies the ceremonial tilak mark to his forehead and takes his ritual cleansing baths yet he pulls out his knife and demands donation with his mouth he recites the vedas in sweet musical notes and yet he does not hesitate from killing human beings says nanak to whomsoever god showers his mercy in his heart he becomes pure and he reflects on the supreme being gauri fifth guru sit steadily in the home of yourself o beloved devotees of the god the true guru has settled all your affairs the transcendent lord has struck down the wicked and evil doers the honor of the lord slave has been preserved by the creator the kings and emperors have been reduced to submission under his power the devotee drinks deeply of the most sublime essence of the ambrosial name fearlessly meditate on the lord god joining the company of the holy and share this gift of lord's meditation with others nanak has entered the sanctuary of the lord the inner knower and grasp the sport of the lord master gauri fifth guru one who is attuned to the lord shall not be burnt in the fire one who is attuned to the lord shall not be enticed by maya one who is attuned to the lord shall not be drowned in the water one who is attuned to the lord is prosperous and fruitful all fear is eradicated by your name joining the holy congregation comes the inspiration to sing the glorious praises of the lord one who is attuned to the lord is free of all anxieties one who is attuned to the lord is blessed with the mantra of the holy one who is attuned to the lord is not haunted by the fear of death one who is attuned to the lord sees all his hopes fulfilled the one attuned to the lord does not suffer in pain one attuned to the lord remains awake and aware night and day one attuned to the lord dwells in the home of intuitive peace one attuned to the lord sees his doubts and fears flee away one who is attuned to the lord has the most sublime and exalted intellect one who is attuned to the lord has a pure and spotless reputation says nanak i am sacrificed to those who do not forget the lord gauri fifth guru through sincere efforts the mind is made peaceful and calm 
walking on the lord's way all pains are taken away chanting the name of the lord the mind becomes blissful singing the glorious praises of the lord supreme bliss is obtained there is joy all around and peace has come to my home joining the company of the holy misfortune disappears my eyes are purified instantly on beholding the blessed vision of his darshan blessed is the forehead which touches his lotus feet working for the lord of the universe the body becomes fruitful by the grace of the saints i have obtained the supreme status the lord is the help and support of his humble servant i have found peace by falling at the feet of his slaves when selfishness is gone then one becomes the lord himself and seeks the sanctuary of the treasurer of the mercy of the almighty lord when someone finds the one he has desired then where should he go to look for him i have become steady and stable and i dwell in the seat of peace by guru's grace nanak has entered the home of peace